Meanwhile, seven major agreements and memoranda of understanding have been signed between Nigeria and the Republic of Turkey. These include energy, defense, industry, mining and hydrocarbons. The agreement signing ceremony was the high point of the two-day visit to Nigeria by President Recep Tayyip Erdogan of the Republic of Turkey. Again, State House correspondent Adam Sambo has that. President Muhammad Buhari and the Turkish leader Rajib Tayyip Erdogan led their respective countries' delegations to the high-level talks where the major agreements and memoranda of understanding were finalized. Consequently, three agreements and four MOUs were signed by the representatives of the two countries. These include agreements on the avoidance of double taxation with respect to taxes and income, defense industry cooperation, as well as cooperation in the field of sports. The memorandum of understanding were on the establishment of mechanisms for political consultations, as well as in the fields of mining, energy, and hydrocarbons. Uh, already we export like one billion scoff of gas to Turkey every year. Um, they want to increase that. Um, also, they are, we are trying to sign uh, a government-to-government -government agreement with them to supply them 15,000 barrels of crude oil every day. So they are really looking to Nigeria uh, for their energy requirements. And the one that affects my ministry is the one to deal with renewable energy, which uh, Turkey government uh, has excelled in that field. So, and as you know, it is the way to go. We want to diversify and move more to the uh, renewable energy, that is uh, the solar, the hydro, and things like that. It is not only Turkey that is going to help us a lot. They are also looking for areas we can assist them. President Muhammad Buhari described the agreements entered into between the two countries as critical to their socio-economic growth and development. We have agreed that implementation is to commence immediately, aimed at strengthening this cordial relationship between Nigeria and Turkey. In the course of our discussions, we also reviewed the travel ban list based on the revised COVID-19 protocols and removed Turkey from Nigeria's travel ban list. Turkey has indeed achieved remarkable success in addressing the COVID-19 pandemic. President Buhari said the Turkish leaders meeting with a joint session of the Nigeria and Turkish Chamber of Commerce and Industry will go a long way in pushing ahead the socio-economic ties between Nigeria and Turkey. I commend your excellency for your leadership and generosity in receiving and accommodating 4 million refugees fleeing from conflict areas, particularly in Iraq, Syria, and Afghanistan. You have indeed set an example to the rest of the world. A state luncheon was later held by the nation's first family in honor of President Erdogan and his wife, as well as members of the Turkish delegation in demonstration of Nigeria's hospitality. From the State House, Adamu Sambu, NTA News.